If you're looking at the screen, it says Consumers Get Health Insurance Cancellation Notices. Many consumers are getting health insurance cancellation notices. Yes, health plans are sending hundreds of thousands of cancellation letters to people who buy their own coverage, frustrating some consumers who want to keep what they have and forcing others to buy more costly policies. What a fiasco. Some of the cancellation notices, however, are going to people with pre-existing medical conditions. The main reason insurers offer is that the policies fall short of what the Affordable Care Act, also known as Obamacare, requires starting January 1st. Most are ending policies sold after the law passed in March 2010. In addition, insurers cannot reject people with medical problems or charge them higher prices. The policies must also cap consumers' annual expenses at levels lower than many plans sold before the new rules came out. By all accounts, the new policies will offer consumers better coverage in some cases for comparable costs, especially after the inclusion of federal subsidies for those who qualify. The law requires policies sold in the individual market to cover uh, 10 essential benefits such as prescription drugs, mental health treatment, and maternity care. But the cancellation notices which began arriving in August have shocked many consumers in light of President Barack Obama's promise that people could keep their plans if they liked them. Here's one example of the frustration. I don't need or I don't feel like I need to change, but I have to, said Jeff Leonard, a television editor in Los Angeles who must find a new plan for his teenage daughter who has a health condition that has required multiple surgeries. An estimated 14 million people purchase their own coverage because they don't get it through their jobs. Calls to insurers in several states showed that many have been sent these notices. Florida Blue, for example, is terminating about 300,000 policies which is about 80% of its individual policies in the state. Kaiser Permanente in California has sent notices to 160,000 people, about half of its individual business in the state. The insurer Highmark in Pittsburgh is dropping about 20% of its individual market consumers, while Independence Blue Cross, the major insurer in Philadelphia, is dropping about 45%. Higher costs? Some receiving cancellations say it looks like their costs will go up despite studies projecting that about half of all enrollees will get income-based subsidies. Yeah. So have you received your notices yet? Are you concerned about your health insurance costs? If so, I would suggest that you go to www.aiadirectquote.com and receive a free quote from multiple carriers to help solve your health insurance issues. Again, that's www.aiadirectquote.com or if you're watching this on YouTube, just merely click the link under this video in the description and get more information today.